finally, before we let Andrex go, about buying one of those lovely little Labrador puppies. Alice will tell you what happens next. Shelley and Duncan belong to Linda and Malcolm Jones. They're 11 months old, and Linda has been doing some sums. I just started sitting down with a piece of scrappy paper, simply writing down, casually, the cost of things, and I was actually staggered. The puppies themselves, pedigrees of course. These two, 275 each, makes 550 pounds. <coughs> Next, somewhere to sleep, two homemade dog boxes. Shelley and Duncan ate them. The blankets were extra. <coughs> Total cost, 58 pounds. Collars and leads. Shelley and Duncan are now on their third set. Cost, 32 pounds. The biggest item, food. The Jones's dogs have complete meal bought in bulk, as well as two Bonio biscuits each a day. It all adds up to £52.50 a month, £630 a year. <coughs> Next, vet fees, inoculations. Shelley needed a leg operation. Duncan needed to have some teeth out. So far, £549. Then there's wear and tear. Uh, this, is, this is the wall. They um, chewed right through and they went through the plaster, through the breeze block, which we've had uh, rebuilt and they've actually tried to have another go at it. They also ate a picture frame, a wicker basket. And the rear seat belts of the car. And the rear seat belts of the car when we first had them. Um, they rattled through them in the space of about half an hour. Repair bills. £20 for the wall, £7.50 for the basket and the picture frame, £176 for the seat belts. Total, £203.50. And finally, to get the dogs trained, they went to school. £1.50 for half an hour. A course of 12 lessons came to £18. The grand total, £2,040.50. The moral of the story, it's cheaper just to buy the loo rolls.